<laughs> Let's go, baby. Good Boba Fett episode two today. Today we have two lightsabers. Apologies for my hair. I look like Kramer today, but yes, we are getting right into episode two. It starts in like a matter of minutes, or it's uploaded in a matter of minutes. But yeah, it's your boy Ellie Moses. Getting right into episode two of Book of Boba Fett. Let's go. I want them to explore more of the bank that back the tank stuff and like the the flashbacks. That I really enjoyed those. <laughs> Perhaps he fears the rancor. <laughs> oh, this guy's ripped. It's empty. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. They didn't get a new one because Luke killed it. Yeah. Oh, wait, did he? No. The tribes of Tatooine. Or oh, as Boba Fett said, Tatooine. <laughs> Entrance. Hot Barber, I did not see your litter arrive. <laughs> Nevertheless, we are both honored and. Bro, he has to get a litter eventually. Like, going against the division. traditions. <laughs> However, I regret to inform you the mayor is indisposed for the rest of the week. Oh, bro, Boba does not this give is, a crap. This, this area here is restricted. For... Oh! Okay. The owner of the night wind are not allowed to operate outside of Hut's Bay. And his reward. I feel like the mayor is playing games here. I don't know. I don't know if he's like a nice mayor or he's actually being straight up or he's dodgy. I am not a bounty hunter. Is that so? I've heard otherwise. Some great makeup no, work there. I love it. Mayor Mokshai sent me here as though there's something I should know. Now you're sweating like a gumped on Mustafa. <laughs> you have a turn. Yo, what's up? What's that? What's the drum beats? Who's coming in? Okay, who's this? Who's this brother? Oh, it's another heart. The twins. Okay, okay. The only other heart I remember is from the Clone Wars. What's his name? Zero the heart. And then he got wrecked, bro. He got betrayed by that. That, that singer cheek. <laughs> bro, that thing is on a curve. Those guys are struggling to carry that. <laughs> that thing is forming a parabola, bro. <laughs> Oh, sh what in the Wookiee is that? All that is his belongs to me now. <laughs> I love how the guys at the front are struggling. You want to get, you'll have to kill me, Warren. I'm interested to see if there's bigger players involved than the cousins. Get out of here, cat in the hat, bro. Let's go, more memories. Come on, come on. <laughs> you gonna learn from the Tuscan warrior, baby. I am holding it the same. Oh, what a shot. <laughs> then my, my little creature had the head glitch and he's like, nah, I'll just take it off. <laughs> is that oh I thought it was a creature oh damn they're getting wrecked man are these like pirates are the Tuscans at war in Tatooine does that look like that's, that's basically a drive-by oh man you kind of feel bad for the Tuscans here man they look it was just helpless. They were just out in the open. I will stop them. I will take rifle and stick. <laughs> One man army. <laughs> Evac. Oh, we're gonna get badass Boba here, man. We're gonna get individual Boba. 
Ah. <laughs> I'm actually enjoying the flashback sequences much more than the actual story they're trying to tell with the huts and stuff. I don't know, I just like it. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, okay. That's not a smart choice to break your gun, but okay. Mallet time. <laughs> Dale, Dale. <laughs> How does he know for sure but those were the guys on the train? Like, yes, they were the ones on the speeders you saw before, but how about the actual train? Because it looked like the guys on the train had a bit of armor on, or like, masks. Yeah, I was about to think to so, is he gonna train him? <laughs> Smart idea. <laughs> I was like, they're not going to accept that the way he thinks they are. <laughs> this makes it stop. Go stop. <laughs> Speedo 101. <laughs> like a Benta. Yes? Like a Benta. <laughs> <laughs> Man, put it in reverse. <laughs> but at least they're practicing too. I like, I like them showing. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> My man did a WWE there. He sold that well. I wonder how many flashbacks we're gonna get to the Tuscan Raiders specifically, like this sequence. Is it gonna need to drag on for the whole season, or is it just gonna be this final one here where he helps them save the train and it's like parting ways thing? Bro, these guys are well fortified in this train, man. It's gonna be hard to stop them. Oh, it's the Pike Syndicate! It's the Pike Syndicate helmet, isn't it? That's mad! Oh, <laughs> he got hooked! Let's see how the Tuscan warrior does, man. He's a beast. Hopefully he doesn't die yet. Oh! <laughs> He's real. <laughs> my man is just... Oh my... This guy's a badass. <laughs> Bro, these Tuscans are gonna use this train for good. But imagine the Jawas come along, bro. They're gonna hustle this, bro. They're gonna rip this to shreds. They're gonna ransack it. Oh, it's weaponry. Damn. And Cause from Clone Wars the Pike Syndicate usually like deals with spice a lot of the times. Or from like memory of the episode. The Let's see, does he rule with fear or respect here? You're going to give us. It depends on how you answer what I'm about to ask. 
<laughs> Are you carrying spice? There we go, the spice, yeah. spice from the slave mines of Kesdin. What does spice look like? <laughs> that? <laughs> but he's capping. Like that. This is not looking good for you. <laughs> if you are to pass the toll, it's to be for each of us. Any death dealt from the passing freighters will be returned tenfold. <laughs> Go yeah. back to your syndicate and present these terms. Your lives are a gesture of our civility. I love the way Tamara Morrison conveys his speech. Like the way he talks is so is so satisfying. You'll file in the direction of the high sun. <laughs> we'll lead you to anchor head by sunset as you leave now. A gift. What do you mean, why, Boba? You've single-handedly like saved them so many times and given them so much. <laughs> oh, it's a little pet. A lizard. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I will let it guide me. <laughs> oh. Wait, what the heck? Did the Tuscan sabotage him? After all he did? Nah, that's a guiding thing, surely. Oh, that's awesome. That's an awesome transition. I like the editing. Camino? Transitions, man. This is all happening in the tent still, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no, he wandered off and came back. Okay, okay. I'm just a bit confused as to what was going on. So it guided him to that tree, I'm guessing. These guys are like, motherfucker, you're gonna die! <laughs> oh, that's how they're gonna, they're gonna make his mallet out of it. Forged from the fires of Mordor. <laughs> Forged from the sands of Tatooine. <laughs> Turning him into a Tuscan radar? Boba radar. <laughs> it's an initiation, bro. <laughs> okay, that's kind of badass, I'm not gonna lie, so. <laughs> and that's the hooded cloak he has in The Mandalorian, I believe, yeah? At the end of season one. I didn't actually expect this episode to spend so much time on the Tuscan Raider story, but it looks like they're concluding it here with his initiation and getting his weapon and he's going to part ways with them. So it's interesting to see are the other episodes going to do with any more flashback scenes or they're just going to go hot, full on on the hut clan thing. I've enjoyed this story with the Tuscan Raiders, but I've, I, really, I, I really have actually. bad not bad i actually quite enjoyed this episode as well i really enjoyed this episode as well i think it's i think we're either going to get a couple more minutes with the tuscan raider clan not much more and i think we're going to continue down the story with the crime lords and what's happening on tatooine at the moment but yeah 
another solid episode. Really enjoyed this one. I'm actually liking this show so far. I love Tamora Morrison. Um, but yeah, I've, I'm actually liking this show. It's a solid start. It's not like amazing and groundbreaking at the moment. But I think it's going to lead to something bigger eventually. And I love the backstory stuff. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. As always, it's been your boy, Moses. Take care. God bless. Peace.